I just published three exclusive ChatGPT classes. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can access them right now. And this technically for free. Hey, what's up, everyone? Ronnie here. Today, I'm coming at you with an opportunity. I've been working a lot on new courses recently, Canva courses, of course, but also ChatGPT courses. I'm really into ChatGPT. And as I'm making some progress with this ChatGPT course, I'm starting to think, where should I publish it? Indeed, Udemy is a great platform, but students expect a fully baked course on Udemy. And me, right now, I'm about 35 40% of the way there with this ChatGPT course. Indeed, that's four out of the 11 sections I'm planning to shoot for this course. So Udemy isn't really the best fit for launching this course right now. And that is because I really want to start pushing this course and put it into you guys' hands as fast as I can, because with OpenAI and ChatGPT, things are moving really fast. And I don't want the content that is already produced and ready to become outdated. So I figured the best way to give you all access to this content would be through Skillshare. Skillshare is known for its shorter classes that are very practical, which is perfect for the ChatGPT GPT course I'm working on. By publishing on Skillshare, I'll be able to push the new sections of the course as individual classes as I finish to produce them with the team. So right now I have three classes that are published on Skillshare that are part of the No BS ChatGPT series. I call it No BS because I really want to cut the fluff on these classes and go straight to practical, actionable ways that you can use ChatGPT to basically get things done for your business, for your personal life. So these are the three classes. I have part one, two, and three, and there will be more. Definitely, I'm planning on adding at least three more to the series. I have already my table of content all written out, so there will be probably a class about ChatGPT for creating content, ChatGPT for social media marketing, ChatGPT for improving your personal life. So these are already three classes that are all kind of mapped out. I just didn't have time to shoot them. But if we come back to what's already there on Skillshare, the first class is the basics, the fundamentals of ChatGPT explained in less than an hour. Okay, so in this class, it's everything really for a beginner. If you're not a beginner, you could skip this class and go straight to class number two. But this one is for the folks who are not yet very comfortable with ChatGPT, teach you everything from creating your free account to starting your first prompt to what is the best formula for prompting ChatGPT effectively. Then we have the second class, which is focused on learning anything, any skill fast and effectively with ChatGPT. So here we have about two hours of content and it covers things like learning from books with the help of ChatGPT, but also developing or designing personalized learning paths to learn pretty much anything you want using ChatGPT as your personal tutor. And finally, to simulate tests and exams to assess what you've learned. So that is in a nutshell class number two, learn any skill faster. And then we have class number three, which is about boosting your writing, writing faster and better with ChatGPT. In this class, we cover all things related to copywriting, how to best use ChatGPT to come up with detailed outlines for your writing projects, your online courses, your online videos, crafting catchy headlines to get people hooked and willing to keep reading your content or clicking on your article or videos, analyzing and reproducing different tone of voice when you write with ChatGPT, writing better emails and saving a ton of time working in your inbox. And then I finished the class by showing you how to accurately translate any text into any language. Okay, so that's what I have right now. About five-ish hours of content that you can access right now. Like literally within five minutes, you could be learning from the first class if you do the following. I have left a link in the description of this video. I believe it will also be in the pinned comment. And this link is my teacher's referral link, which will give you 30 days of free trial for Skillshare. So during this period of 30 days, which I believe is two weeks longer than if you sign up to Skillshare from their website. So during these 30 days, you can use Skillshare and consume any classes you want. Kind of like a buffet restaurant where you can eat all you can. Well, same here. You can consume all the classes you can for 
30 days. Now, you will probably be asked to enter a payment method, but you will still have the 30 day free trial. So you won't be charged for the first 30 days. Only on the 31st day will your payment method be charged, but you can cancel if you decide Skillshare is not for you, which I doubt because it's really valuable. You can decide to cancel that trial and you won't be charged anything. That would be the end of the story. And if you do like it, if you happen to find some value on Skillshare, feel free to stay there. That's when I will get my commission and you will get plenty of courses to learn from. So to recap, to access the 30 free days, use the link in the description, or you can use this QR code right here. And once you do, you should see this. So an invitation from me to try Skillshare for one month. Now, if you're watching us from India, listen carefully, because I've been told by the Skillshare team that unfortunately in India, there is no 30 day free trial. I think it's a legal thing, but I prefer to be fully transparent with you guys. If you're from India, this won't apply to you, unfortunately. It's not my fault. It's a decision. I believe from the Indian government forcing companies not to give free trial, something like that. Not completely sure. Anyways, if you are from any other countries, you are entitled to these 30 free days. Now, once you are in and you've started your free trial, you can access not only the three ChatGPT classes I was telling you about, but you can access all of my classes on Skillshare. When you visit my Skillshare profile, you will see that I have 22 other classes available. So these are mostly Canva classes, entire Canva for social media course, or I call it series here, divided into five different classes. We have the entire Rondi bootcamp. So that's the equivalent on Udemy of the Canva next level course. Everything is right here on Skillshare as well. So these are 10 classes. They are all here with some very popular ones like this one right here, create irresistible YouTube thumbnails. And these Canva classes are still very relevant today. Some of the UI UX of Canva might have changed slightly, but 95% of this content is still very accurate and will help you in your Canva or designer journey. So that's for the Canva classes. I have some older ones as well that have been popular, but they are kind of older. Then I also have a branding class called 15 steps to improve your branding, which I do recommend you check out. It's a little bit less than an hour and obviously the no BS chat GPT series. So that's my profile, my courses. And I've done the math preparing for this video and it's about roughly 35 hours of content. So a full week that you could be learning with me for free if you use the link below. Now, as I told you, you can cancel that free trial at any time within the first 30 days, okay? But I honestly believe you should stick to Skillshare because it's a real value bomb for people like us. And by that, I mean digital entrepreneurs, content creators, anyone really working in the gig economy or in the creative economy. Skillshare is really the platform with a bunch of classes that are really geared at this type of audience. Each of these classes are focused on practical knowledge and skill acquisition. And they have this system of every class kind of goes together with a project. So a project that the students have to complete in order to finish the class. So I really think that these class projects add a lot to the practicality of these classes because not only are you learning, but you are doing, you are kind of like executing on the skills you've learned immediately via the course project. Another reason why I think you should stick to Skillshare is that I personally am committed to publishing more classes there throughout the year and probably the years to come because I really like this platform and I like the format. You don't have to publish like a 10 hour course. I could go with the like 50 minute, one hour course, publish it and move to the next one, which is a rhythm that kind of suits me and the type of content I'm creating right now. So you can expect more classes from me and Team Rondi on Skillshare. And then of course you have the classes from all the other teachers on the platform. And you could learn some cool creative things like doing illustrations or drawing 
growing on your iPad. Storytelling. There's a bunch of storytelling classes on the platform or more specific skills like taking care of plants. I've seen a class on Skillshare about taking care of your plants. I should probably take that class. Or finding your first client, which could be super useful for some of you starting a career as a freelancer. So the bottom line is I think you should try Skillshare. Give it a spin, use the 30 free days, cancel if it's not for you, and let me know what you think. Like take some of my classes if you wish, get the classes from the NoBS ChatGPT series, maybe try some of my other classes, try other teachers' classes, and most importantly, enjoy the learning.